Hi boys and girls, my name is Mr Curry and this is Mr Martin. Today we'll be taking you on your very first online learning program. Now today's focus is all about fundamental movement skills. But before we get started on our journey, I just wanted to talk to you about safety. Make sure at home you have a nice clear space to do all of the wonderful activities. Number two, make sure you don't do it on a slippery surface. All right, boys and girls, let's get started. Boys and girls, welcome to our first lesson. Now, I am very, very excited today, and I have a lot of activities that we're gonna be working on. But let me break it down a little bit for you. We're gonna be working on some coordination skills. I'll explain what that means in a minute. And we're also gonna be working on some balance skills. Now, coordination. Huge word, let's break it down. It's about using different body parts to perform an activity. Balance, it's about trying to find the best position so I can keep super still, all right? So I'm gonna go through these activities with you and we're gonna have lots of fun with it. The first activity, the first activity I have in my bucket of treats here, it's gonna be called the cup throwing challenge. Now, all you need is a piece of equipment, whether it happens to be a coin, and then you're gonna need some type of cup. I'll use that, I'll leave that up to you to figure out what you're gonna do with it. All right, let's get started with it. So, here's my cup, let's call it level one. Level one, up, catch, all right? We'll try that again. I want you to do that one three times in a minute, not yet though. So, ready? Level one, just like that. All right, I want you to go practice that one three times. Now, we're gonna move on to level two. Now, level two, we're gonna get a little bit trickier. So we've come in and now we come out. All right, that's level two. Let's try it again. Coin in and coin out, just like that. So the system to this is all about keeping those eyes focused on the activity. That is the secret to any coordination activity. Keep the eyes focused on what we're doing. All right, I want you to try that three times. And let's now move on to level three. All right, now this one's tricky. I'm just gonna let you know I'm a little nervous with this one because this one's tricky. All right, boys and girls, so if I drop it, please excuse me. Here's how it's gonna work. Queen is gonna go into the cup. I'm gonna transfer the cup over to the other hand and I'm gonna try and catch it as soon as it hits the ground. Right, that was a lot of words. Let's see if we can do it. Ready, ready, ready. And up. Oh, and I got it into the target. All right, boys and girls, let's try one more time. Then I'm gonna leave it with you for three attempts. All right, we ready? I'm ready. Okay, I'm ready. And up. And I was successful with that one. Have a go at it three times, boys and girls. All right. All right, boys and girls. Now we've gone through the cup throwing activity. Let's move on to juggling. Now we're gonna keep it really, really simple for all you boys and girls at home, but we are gonna have a lot of fun with it. So we're never gonna move beyond two balls. So let's call it level one. Level one, I pick up my ball and all we're really trying to do here is see whether we can catch the ball, okay? Let's see, ball in hand and I'm just gonna come over here. I'm just gonna come over here. So I'm just gonna go from here. As you can see what I'm doing, my eyes never come off the ball. My eyes never come off the ball. And I have a system, a process. So that means I know what I'm doing. I'm not making it up, I know what I'm doing. That's level one. I want you to spend a little bit of time on that one and then we'll come back for level two. All right, level two. So as I spoke about, we're gonna be putting Two balls into the mix now, two balls into the activity. This is gonna be pretty challenging. However, I want you to work through it with me. And I think if we work on that process, if we work on that system, I think we can do this. All right, team? So two balls in my hand. Here's what I'm gonna do. I just wanna throw my ball up and then I'm gonna catch it. One more time, I'm gonna throw my ball up and I'm gonna catch it. So we try, wanna try to get a little bit of height, not too much, wanna get a little bit of height up here and then there. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna move on and ball comes up, ball comes up, catch. Ball comes up, ball comes up, 
catch. So you'll see there, both balls are in the air. Spend a little bit of time on this one. I know this one might be a bit challenging at first, but if we work through the process, ball up, ball up, catch, catch. That's the method to it. See how you go with it. Okay, boys and girls, that covers the coordination side of what we're gonna be working on. Let's move on to balance. So now we're gonna be moving around a little bit. We'll see how we go with it. Here's what we're gonna do. Feet apart, I want you to keep your eyes locked on me. This one here is called the wall sit challenge. So if you have a wall close by that you can move to, here's what I want you to do. I want you to go up to the wall. I want you to sit down on the wall like this and we're gonna hold. Hold in this squat position here. I want your hands up like this and now we're gonna make it a little bit trickier. I want your elbows up and you're gonna put one hand up in the air like this. And let's see how long we can hold. When we lose our balance, we come up and then we start again. And then we move on to level two. Level two is gonna be a little bit trickier, but it's still working on our balance. All right, feet apart, toes down, down into my squat position on my wall, hands together, one hand up, and now we're gonna put another hand up. Just in this position here, holding, holding, holding. You see how long you can hold that for? The big challenge would be 20 seconds. If that's too long, we'll work on five seconds, 10 seconds, whatever you feel comfortable with, that's your first balancing challenge. Number two, this one here is called the Bridge Transfer Challenge. Now I'm excited about this one. I love this activity. Let me go back and dig into my bucket here and I have these three pieces of equipment. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to place my pieces of equipment just here, just on the floor here. And the aim of this game is to transfer everything down here into the bucket. Now, we're gonna get into what we call the bridge position. Here's what it looks like. Feet up, sorry, feet down rather, hands down, and I'm gonna stay here. Now, everything over here needs to end up in the bucket. Here's what it looks like. All right, we're ready for the challenge. And first piece of equipment over into the bucket. Next piece of equipment, oh, I've missed that one, and into the bucket. Next one, and into the bucket. All right, hold this position. Three, two, and one, and then we come down. All right, last activity we're gonna be doing is the plank challenge. Now, here's what it's gonna look like. Down into your plank position, so that's like this. Down in this position here, and all we're gonna do is we're gonna stay like this. This is level one. Keeping your eyes straight down at your hand and holding. One, two, three, four, and five. I want you to come up, have a little bit of a rest, and we're gonna move on to level two. All right, little rest, down. And from here, I want you to lift one hand up. One, two, three, four, and five. Little rest, down. And the last one, what we're gonna do is with the other hand. Down here. One, two, and back down. All right, all the way back up. Thank you very much, boys and girls, for joining me today with your first fundamental movement skills lesson.